Hi, I'm Elon from Keytech Industries. Today, I'm going to showcase the DigiClaw Drywall 2540 granulate dryer on our Jarvis Pro Extruder. Making high quality 3D printing filament isn't easy. Nearly all materials need to be dried before extrusion in order to prevent small bubbles and irregularities in your filament and ensure a consistent diameter. Drying granulate is less trivial than you might think because you need to reach a specific humidity threshold for each material and over or under drying will disrupt your process. This is why we joined forces with Germany's leading manufacturer for high-end granulate dryers, Digi Color. This is the Drywall 2540, which we can easily attach to our standard four-screw mount on the Jarvis Pro Extruder. The simplest form of drying works by just pumping hot air through the hopper. And because hot air is able to absorb more moisture, the granulate slowly gets drier. We use this method too with our 30 year old granulate dryer, but it's just terribly energy inefficient and very ineffective. More advanced drying solutions utilize two water absorbent units, which you can compare to these little packets of silica gel that you can find in your shoe boxes. So first the hot air is pumped through these water absorbent units and it contains nearly no moisture when passing through the granulate, making the drying process far more effective. As soon as one of the water absorbent units has absorbed its maximum amount of moisture, the system switches to the other absorbent unit, while the first one regenerates. The regeneration is done by heating the absorbent to very high temperatures, so it releases the water. The problem with this method is that the drying rate steadily declines until the system switches to the fresh regenerated absorbent, resulting in a spike in the drying curve. The Digicolor Drywall is the solution for this problem because it utilizes a circulating absorbent unit that is consistently regenerating, enabling complete consistency in the drying process, perfect for technical and more challenging polymers. It comes equipped with a sensor measuring the exhaust temperature, so it automatically goes in a low temperature safety mode when the polymer is being overdried. All settings are highly customizable using the display control. You can even set a time where the dryer should start so the material is ready when you want to start production in the morning. We are currently integrating the drywall control into our Jarvis open source software. So all parameters are measured and values are accessible in one central place. If you want to learn more about the Jarvis Pro Extruder and the drywall, feel free to visit our website or contact us via email, WhatsApp or phone. Make sure to check out our social media where we will keep you updated on our progress and development.